Hi there, I wanted to share a little bit about this book that I was privileged to illustrate. This is actually one of my favorite books to have illustrated, and I've illustrated, I think, about 45 children's books at this point. It's on Amazon, both paperback and hardcover, and I'll share a little bit of my process here. I always do covers last. Um, but I designed this character, this stork, and the client, the author, had a lot of photo reference of different outfits he wanted him to be wearing on different pages, and there's all sorts of fancy clothes. It's a very dapper stork. So after we designed the stork, then I had to use that photo reference to give him some fun different outfits. I mean, even to the point of some interesting socks and things like that. It was a real fun challenge to be a part of. I got to do all these different fun animals and get real expressive with them. And it, it was pretty fun to put the stork in a different outfit on every page. This is one of my favorite pages as he's surprising this ladybug in her little, little box house. This is another favorite here. The mom's telling him, get rid of this stork. He's been overstaying his welcome. So it was fun to try to create the environments for each of the animals, where they would live and where he would be dropping off the animals. So I loved getting real expressive with this, even having little horse hoof sneakers and things like that. It's fun to do. And you see, the one thing I've never seen a cartoon stork do when delivering a baby is delivering an underwater baby. So I thought it'd be fun uh, to show him scuba diving, delivering a little baby shark. And it was fun too because the author was open to me choosing whatever animals for the text on the page. And so I had a fun time picking out what animals to illustrate on each each page, which is pretty fun to do. You can see the environments kind of catering towards the animals and things like that. So it was a, a lot of fun, and a lot of fun coming up with the different outfits for the stork, and um, just bringing this story to life. It's such a cute, endearing story, and it's fun to end it with him delivering a, a human baby. And uh, I hope you liked it. Um, you can see more about my process for this book on my website, freelancefridge.com. And you can reach out to me there, too, if you'd like me to illustrate your book. Thanks for taking a look.